Well, I'm here at the Muscolero Community Center and Muscolero Apache Tribal Headquarters where volunteers have been unloading supplies all day long. Now, there are dozens of people, some from as far as Las Cruces and Santa Fe. One volunteer I spoke with from Las Cruces said he just couldn't stay away. So quick and my first thought was trying to get out of work and see how I could come over here and help my family out. For the past few days, organizers here at the community center have worked with out-of-towners to get locals the supplies they need. One Alamogordo public school employee said it's all hands on deck. People keep filling the buses down in Alamogordo and we keep bringing them up here. Verdoso is a big part of the community down there as well. Like all the villages kind of stick together, but to, to see what they're losing is just, uh, it's heartbreaking. Donovan Balsley, the transportation coordinator for the public schools, say they have six school buses filled with supplies like hygiene products, food, and water going back and forth every day. Just a, it's a huge group, group effort. Everybody's working together. You know, the churches are working together. We're working together in the city. Dwayne Duffy, vice president of the Tribal Executive Committee, says support efforts are finally starting to run smoothly. The last 72 hours have been chaos. Um, really, within the last 12 hours, everything has been setting in place and, you know, getting the emergency operations center going here. Duffy says after the fire, he's concerned about potential flooding coming from incoming rains. And so ensuring that, you know, we don't have anybody in the way of those uh, flood waters downstream once the, you know, once the rains hits or, you know, anything like that. Duffy told me they have their own specialized fire team called the Hot Shots that joins those coming from outside in fighting both these fires. Now, if you want to help those in need, you can drop supplies here at the Muscolero Community Center or at the Walmart in Alamogordo.